Uh, conception of the idea to now has probably been about a year and a half. You know, there was hours over spring break we were putting in uh, 120 hours a week. Things aren't always ideal. Most engineering problems in the classroom, you know, you deal with uh, ideal scenarios where you're not going to have interferences, you're not able to see. Just seeing, seeing those problems and being able to work through them as a team uh, has been huge. It was a fantastic opportunity to compete against the world. There are a few competitions that allow for regional competition, but this was a chance to test our engineering prowess literally against the world. Um, it's a little, little bit of a beast to drive. Um, I, I wouldn't say that it's a, a smooth, easy ride, but it is definitely uh, very capable when it comes to the obstacles and the course that, that was ahead of us. It's 100% adrenaline rush. <laughs> I mean, we put so much into this, so much time and effort, um, and just blood, sweat, and tears into this thing for a year and a half, and to finally be out there, you know, at NASA's Rocket City, um, it, was, it was exhilarating. And to, to get that go, to, to run the course, it was just, it was a blur. It was a, a great exposure to you know engineering um, and working as a team and the the design of it was was just great. It was it was really beneficial to apply all of these concepts that we've learned for the last you know four or five years um, and to finally put them together into a, a functional, practical build. Not just design something on paper to but to actually come up with a design, run the calculations and all the numbers, but then to turn around and build it. I mean it, it was really really beneficial and, and, and an amazing experience.